Recording meetings in person is easy, but what about recording meetings online? Hi, I'm Beth from Blue Dot, and in today's video, I'm gonna run through some features of AI meeting recorders and how a meeting recorder like Blue Dot could help to improve your meeting workflow. And we're gonna jump straight in with the use of bots. So with TLDV, you're gonna to need to invite a bot to your meeting. To do this, you're just gonna to wanna to click on the button at the bottom. And then as you can see, it's gonna take a bit of time for the bot to actually come into the meeting. You'll then get a notification and you just have to admit the bot into the meeting. And once you've accepted it, you'll then see that the bot is actually visibly in the meeting. So all of your attendees will be able to see the bot like it's another person. And it's a very similar story for Fireflies.ai. It's like TLDV, your bot is gonna be physically in your meeting, looking like another person. And you are gonna to have to invite it to the meeting as well. You can either set up regular meetings that the bot joins by default, or you can add it to an ad hoc meeting as well. If you do wanna add it to an ad hoc meeting, all you need to do is go into your Google Meet and start a meeting then copy the link and if you go back into fireflies.ai you'll see in the top right hand corner of the screen um, a button that says add to live meeting if you click on that there's then space to put your google meet link and then you can start capturing like with TLDV, you are gonna to have to wait a little while for the bot to join the meeting when it is ready to join you'll see a little pop-up on the bottom right hand corner of the screen and you'll just need to admit the bot to the meeting. Once you've done that, like TLDV, it will show up on the screen like a real person in the meeting. And it's worth noting that if you leave the meeting early, then the bot is gonna stay in the meeting unless you physically remove it. And that's the same with TLDV as well. Unlike Fireflies.ai and TLDV, Blue Dot doesn't have any physical bots. So to start the meeting recording, all you have to do is press Command, Shift and S. Once you've done this, you'll see at the bottom that it says the recording is active and then everything happens in the background. There aren't any physical bots in the meeting, so you won't have to explain to the other attendees why it looks like there's another person in the meeting. The first time you use it, you'll also be able to choose settings such as whether you want the audio as well as the video recorded and in what language you usually speak. And when you end the meeting, the recording also completely stops. So moving on to some of the features of the three tools. And as you would expect, all three of the tools do transcribe the meeting for you really easily. But there are some slight differences in what each of them can offer. So you'll see with Blue Dot, as soon as I ended my meeting, the transcription comes up straight away. Whereas with Fireflies.ai, you are going to have to wait a little while for that transcript to show up. But when it does, it will show up on the right hand side of the screen. And for TLDV, you're going to have to go back into the site, click on the meeting that you want the transcript for. And then at the top right, you'll see either video or transcript. Script. So moving on to insights and each of the tools do have some really great insight features so let's highlight some of them. In this instance there was only me in the meeting but ordinarily if there's more than one person you'll be able to see who spoke the most and also who spoke for the longest period of time. And another really useful feature for the AI summary is that you can create your own custom template. So you can add in questions based on what usually comes up in your meetings and then the summary will be based around those questions. Once you've done that, Blue Dot will then make you a summary based on the questions that you've typed in. And if you want it to, Blue Dot can even send you and your other teammates if you want it to an AI generated email based on a summary it creates of the meeting. You'll see that it will bring it up in your email mailbox and then you can just add information or take information away as you wish to and then send it to whoever you want to in your organization or beyond. Similarly, TLDV can send you an AI report at the end of the week or the month based on multiple meetings throughout that time period. And then fireflies.ai also has some useful tools such as a sentiment analysis based on the transcript of the meeting that it's created. So they're the main things that each tool can do and what differentiates the tools for how much do you have to pay to access all of this. As you'll see on my screen, there are free versions of all of the tools. And then I will run through a list now of all of the other options on my screen. So if you are interested and you wanna compare, then make sure to take photos now. So you'll see that Blue Dot has options ranging from $0 a month all the way up to $32 per month. And then also the option for an enterprise plan. And all of those prices are based on if you pay annually. So similarly, if you pay annually for TLDV, then there are also three options before you then come to the custom plan, again ranging from $0 per month, but this time up to $59 per month. And then finally, Fireflies.ai actually has four different options. Again, based on paying annually, and it does start at $0 per month, but this time the most expensive package is $39 per month. But there are a few key differences between the tools that are worth noting. For example, with Fireflies.ai, if you want to video record the meeting as well as recording the audio for the transcript, then you will have to pay for their business option, which is $19 per month. Whereas Blue Dot and TLDV do both include video recording in their free package. And with Blue Dot, that meeting recording can be up to one hour. For an unlimited duration, you'd have to pay $20 per month for our pro package. It's worth noting with Blue Dot that you only have to pay for one subscription and then you can invite as many people from your team as you want to, which is something that you can't do with every AI note taker. So that gives you an idea of what each tool can offer. The question of which is gonna be best for you is obviously subjective, so do go away and have a play with all three. And to head to Blue Dot's website for more information, then you can follow the direct link in the video description.